Hey everybody, I'm Tony, and this is my husband Henry, and he got in the mail his Battlestar Galactica Modern Cylon Raider ship. Henry, you want to say some stuff about it? Yeah, this is from the Reimagined series. Uh, love that series. I think they did a good job with it. Still, still a huge fan of the old series, so be a fan of both. I just love the ships from both. Doesn't matter. So we are going to open this. This is from Eagle Moss. The links for everything will be down below. So first thing when we open the box is it's packed in styrofoam very well. Now Eagle Moss is pretty much known for packing their stuff right, right? Not the little. Well, well, we'll not the out. little ships sometimes, but they're real. Their customer service is really good. Comes with a little booklet about the ship. Now, I am not going to do what I did last time. Moment of truth. Um, Don't drop wow. it. Wow. The first thing I noticed. That is beautiful. Is the weight. You feel that? Ooh, that does have some weight. And I, I just got to say this real quick. So, do you see this? This is beautiful. But the first thing I thought of is I don't know if you can see it right here this part right here reminds me of the head of the alien doesn't it like you expect <laughs> to come out at you okay you know let's go on okay so first you gotta look I have I haven't opened this beforehand yeah, wow that's and, got some weight and I do see what she's talking about now now if if any of your fans of the reimagined series it they tried to stay with the old, you know, put some old into it so you can see in the face, it is an actual face. Um, these things, if you watch the series, they're technically alive. So there is a, there's a face and it has a resemblance of the old Cylon Centurions built within the ship and it's, it, it really is amazing. That is nice. That's yes. got some good. Yeah, they're die cast metals. They're die cast metal. And uh, the detail is really good. It's the painting. I know somebody asked me about painting uh, one of the different ships. And I will answer that question. Just haven't got to it yet. But it, it, it's, <laughs> it's really, really pretty. Um, it does have... A base to it which I'm not going to test out this time so <laughs> you know uh, okay here's the uh, I'm just gonna this is that really is beautiful all right, let's try to see how this no. uh, yeah I'm not gonna case. do it so um, it, I'm trying to see from the bottom oh okay I see how it works okay so I'm not gonna do this but it kind of Oh. fits like that okay. if you can see it and there's a little other little plastic base to it but <laughs> yeah I'm not really sure so I'd go like yeah this. it fits right underneath the uh, the front of it so it it really didn't lock in place but they're pretty oh. okay. yeah they're, Okay. There we go. Oh, it does lock in place. It, it, lock, okay. it locks in place. It's got little grooves underneath there, and it does lock in place. And I'm wondering. It comes off really easily, so if you get this, be careful. Make sure you put it where you want it to stand. But, oh, this is nice. See, she was like, she, I don't particularly know about you subscribing to this. So, <laughs> but. This is very nice. The geek in me is going, wow, that is really cool. Oh, I would love she never to watched. It. Well, I will display it. It's mm, you got a lot going on in our lives right now. It's I have like so a, many. There's so much that I need to get displayed. And then it comes with like a little stand. And what's so that on the would, bottom? It says Martin Cylon Raider. Oh. So you get the little stand, you would put this in it, and then you put that on top. That's yeah, how and it, it comes fits in there really well. So it's really well protected, packed in there. 
I I like that. Now, in my job, I deal with a lot of things that have been packed, and that's a good job. That is a very good job. So. There, uh, Eagle Moss is doing a lot better with their larger ships. They have their smaller ships, which they mass produce. So it's it's I can see where it's difficult to package them. They're really they're die cast metal, so I like the quality. But every now and then I get one that's not. It comes apart. I don't know so much it's broken as it's it comes apart. They their slots maybe need some a little more glue, but um, I like the overall subscription. So far I've got like 120 some ships of the smaller version, but, and every now and then through the subscription, they would send you a larger one, uh, depending on, you know, Enterprise, love the Voyager one. I'm gonna, I've got to answer that question about Voyager, but uh, the, the only thing I can say about Ego Moss about the smaller ones, which I'm getting a little off track over, but they 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 really put in some obscure ships. So I'm like, I, I don't remember seeing this one. So this is a ship that was in the background in that one yeah, scene. Yeah, like that. but I'm really looking forward to the Battlestar Galactica series. The next one is the New Galactica, and I am stoked for that. I, it's I'm I, like. Like, I've got to wait, like, two, three months for that one. You can pre-order it. I think you can even purchase it at this point. So, Eagle Moss, please, you know, sponsor us. I don't care. Just give me a little something, something. But, no, I, I'm really looking forward to this this series. I can't wait. The Galactica is, like, the, that ship, the Battlestar. It's, uh, yeah, that's my favorite. And, uh. Even on my license plate, I have BSG-75, which yes. a lot of people don't get that, but it's you can see it in the background in a lot of the screenshots, so, or the shots. Now, Henry, how much was this ship? Uh, it was only $2. This one? <laughs> there was no. a two in the front of all those numbers? No, no, no. It's, it's uh, I think it's like fifty four ninety five. It's basically $55, but... The, if you do the subscription, they send them to you every two months. So it's, and you can get discounts though. Ego Moss is really, their newer ships, they don't offer the discounts. Uh, they'll send out like coupons. Like a coupon code? Yeah, okay. but they don't, for the newer ones, it takes a while for that to kick in for them. Because they exclude them. Okay. But I, I think overall it's a good deal. I did like this one. I did like this one. This is really nice. And hopefully you will display it soon. Yes. I really need to. So if anybody has... I, I'm still looking for options on how I have a... I have my own computer room. And we have... I have a really solid idea finally for how to display them. But I'm open to any and all suggestions. So if you want to post a picture, if you have displays of these, yes. I, I would really love ideas. All right, so maybe once that room gets done, we could do a, like a little room tour. We got these really uh, really great glass cases from Ikea, which... Are really reasonably priced. Honestly, those are, yeah, they're not that expensive and they can hold a good amount and they're made really well. So, we got, we did this unboxing. Can't wait to see what else comes in this collection. And... Thank you guys for joining us on this video. If you have any comments, like I say, put them down in the comment below. All the links will be down in the description box. And like and subscribe. And we will do, let's see, I say we link the my favorite, the last one that we did where he dropped it. you got to watch that video. It is amazing. Oh. And it's actually the number one. Yeah, we, we have a lot of views on, on that. Channel of all it's, things I have. We, and... Put the comments, you know. Yeah. I, we, we love to hear from, oh, the, yeah. you know, it's. So, yeah. So, I will link that video here. My channel is there. And we'll see you guys for the next unboxing. Bye.